Hello Booktube, this is Leo of A Little Book Life. Many of us Booktubers and subscribers also, I think, have made friends here from all over the world, with whom we talk about the books we read or whom we buddy read books with. Sometimes these friendships turn into personal ones where we know about each other's lives and in some cases even meet each other in real life at a certain point. One of my friends is Jesper, a lovely, kind and smart man who has not a booktube channel but has a, a really great Instagram channel, link below. He's Danish but lives now in Florida and we came up with this idea that I'd like to share with you because it might be a nice one for you and your bookish friends to copy. We came up with the idea of reading a novel from each other's native li literature and call it, well actually Jasper came up with the name, the Native Book Swap. What we did is that each of us presented to the other one a list of three novels of our native literature that we really liked ourselves and we suspect the other might like too. The novels must be translated into English and when it's translated into the other one's native literature language, that's of course great too. The other one then researches the three books online to get a sense of what it's about and then picks one that she or he is going to read. And then you will tell your friend, of course, what you thought of the novel. I think it's a wonderful thing to do between bookish friends and maybe it is something that you might consider doing also. Because it gives you a little peek into each other's country, as for the literary side. And when you're friends, at least in my book, you take an interest in each other. So what did we both pick? Jesper chose to read Bonita Avenue by Peter Buwalda as his Dutch novel. Available under the same title in both. Danish and English translation. Bonita Avenue is Peter Bowalder's debut novel and was a literary sensation when it came out in the Netherlands in 2010. Set in both the Netherlands and the USA, it is a fast-paced page-turner about a minister of education whose children get involved in criminal activities. And I chose to read Prophets of Eternal Fjord by Kim Leine, published in Denmark in 2012 under the title, and now please bear with me, Profeten i Evighilsfjorden. It is an epic novel about a Danish missionary who travels to Greenland in 1793 and gets involved in the Greenlanders' aspirations for a better society. According to the back cover, it takes the reader on a journey from the streets and alleys of Copenhagen to the bleakest backs of beyonds of Greenland. So that sounded very interesting to me. Well, that was it for this time, a short one, and I hope you will find this idea as nice as Jesper and I do. Let me know in the comments if you would like to try to do the same with one of your bookish friends also. And bye bye!